So I'm here at EGX 2016 uh, with Tom and Hannah from Humble Grove. I've just had a chance to play 29. Um, I kind of said to you before we started, I wish there was more, but I kind of don't wish there was more. Can you talk us through kind of what we've, what we've got here today, what's in the build here that's at EGX this weekend? Sure, um, so it's about, uh, it's about two characters who are just about to move out of their house and um, the, one of them has to go back to uh, Tokyo where they're from. So it's a very personal uh, story and it deals with, deals with issues of mental illness and, and gender. It's piqued a massive curiosity in me in the fact that I want to keep delving deeper and deeper and deep, deeper into it. I think I'm in yeah. quite a good position now where, because there's not that much there. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> we, we definitely have a lot more planned. Yeah. Um, we, we have actually got um, several episodes planned. There's a lot more to come. And yeah. what was the kind of the genesis for the idea? You said it was semi-autobiographical. Was it? What kind of sparked the idea and made you work towards this story as opposed to kind of another project? It was during my um, last year at uni that um, we got to know each other. So, like, we really wanted to work on a on a project together. So I think like uh, like one day we just decided to make something about our flat, and it wasn't supposed to be that big either. And we were just kind of like, yeah, let's model our flat and um, yeah, memories because we're moving out of this place and we're very fond of it. Do you think it's something that's, that's really helped form it? Because I think part of its charm is that it's it's kind of blocked into a flat. There's only so far you can go right. instead of it being, yeah. uh, the art style is beautiful, but instead of it being a whole world with this beautiful art style, yeah. it's, it's such a singular thing within what's theoretically a bigger world. There's other stuff going on outside. Yeah, yeah. There, well, there, there will be other stuff outside, but it will still be like focused in these uh, very small buildings. It is like um, intentionally claustro, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> and then this is going to sound like a fever dream sentence to make together but it's like blocked into a small space and at the same time is like infinite all sorts of things going yeah. on it's got a, i found that the a great part of its charm is that it's small and massive at the same time kind of thing. right yeah we want to sort of make reference to other stuff that's going on in the world outside of what's what's in like the flat we and could, like, all the technically other go to space from the the bathroom, right, so yeah. I mean. <laughs> and um, so when, when can we look, we look forward to maybe seeing more from it, maybe getting our hands on it? Is there any kind of plan um, in terms of rolling it out? Yeah, we've got, we're planning on hopefully getting this this first chapter out uh, end of the year, maybe early next year. Really, I look forward to it. Thank you very much, guys. I'm here at EGX 2016. I've just had a got to have a... <laughs> we're here at EGX 2016. Oh, <laughs> It's the name of the game that we're about to do. Think about. Day four for us as well. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm, I'm flagging now. I am. <laughs> so I'm here at EGX 2016. That sounded really weird. Like, so. <laughs> what was your name again, mate? Uh, Mitch. Mitch. Cool. Good. I would, I would have said Mark, and that would have been wrong. <laughs> so that's good. <laughs>